finally, I'm gonna get my hair done today. So guys, finally splurged. Got myself some new bathing suits, um, which kind of isn't that appropriate, but it's really cute. Hey guys, welcome back to Our Family Nest. So today's a pretty exciting day. Carly's getting her hair done. Finally getting her highlights touched up. And um, also I wanted to share with you guys because so many of you swore that we needed to watch Outer Banks and give it a second try because we watched the first we watched the first episode and then like the beginning of the second one and I'm telling you some of the acting is just so terrible that we were like we're not watching this like it just we didn't understand the plot behind it we didn't think it was very good so we all stopped watching it well we decided to give it a second try um because you guys recommended it and another reason which we have find out here very soon and um we are now on episode four and i mean i guess it's a little better there's still certain points that you're just like oh my god the acting i don't feel like this is a common trend with netflix original shows like i feel like most of them are usually pretty good and the acting's pretty good but for some reason i don't know i guess maybe because these actors are younger and maybe not a as experienced maybe that's what it is or the director's fault or something i don't know anyways um it is getting a little bit better so we're going to keep watching so i really kind of wish i could get my hair done too but i feel like it's just too soon it's such a orangey brassy color this just i mean i guess it's fine for summer it's just uh really turned way more orange than I would like it to be but then again every so often I'll see somebody with hair that's got like reddish orange highlights in it and I'm like oh that's really cute so we're just gonna go with it until my roots grow out a little bit more but I'm really excited because my normal hair girl where I go in our town she texted me and said they open back up and I made myself appointment to be able to go back and get my hair done like normal. Probably darken this up a little bit and um, I don't know, add some highlights, but more of like a blonde highlight instead of the orangey color. Could be too, I'm just spending so much time in the sun that um, the sun's lightened my hair too. So I'm really actually, look at how dark I'm getting guys. Getting pretty tan already, so summer summer it's like not even summer yet but it's almost here so i'm in my kitchen making myself a sandwich and it's not going very well i'm kind of struggling but it's fine but finally i'm gonna get my hair done today and if you look at it it actually looks really good right now doesn't it the mm -hmm. but the top of my hair looks disgusting it's very dark and brown and not that dark hair is disgusting, but on me, I'm not the biggest fan. Like, what is this? Anyway, I just wanted to show you guys what my hair looks like before I dye it, and I'm going to dye it Tucker's color. <laughs> Could you imagine? Top of his head. <laughs> what color would you call that? Actually, put your hair. Blonde. Put your hair down it's there. It's probably not that different. It's pretty, pretty close. <laughs> Might look like that by the end of the day, don't you think? Why are you wearing your new shorts now? And your new shirt. Yeah, I feel like it. Yeah, but the they thing look is, cute. they're really big and they don't have a tie. And if you fold them over, this tie. Uh, I didn't put it in the exact. <laughs> this tie here's cutting me. So, finally got my skateboard. Oh, I think I got my hair done. <laughs> so her hair is done. Turn, Turn around. It's really short. It's Carly. I feel like my hair keeps getting shorter and shorter. She cut what? An inch off of it? Maybe, but my skateboard came in. It's very plain. I really thought I was going to hate the wheels, but I think they look cool. Is there anything on the back? No. Uh, like, here, here's Chase's. Like, look, his has, like, all this on it. You're, it's going under the car. Oh, look at already has dirt on it. It's going to be a problem. Oh, yeah, it's going to get dirty. That's okay. Anyways, well, Chase's just came with the cat, and then he put all those stickers. Yeah, but I don't like, I like it simple, don't you? Mm-hmm. Like. I so you're not putting anything on it? No, I like it like this. It's not really pretty. Yeah, but it's not going to stay that nice. It's going to get dirty. The top is going to get really dirty. Ew, I don't, I don't like to. You're going to have to 
Chase is gonna have to fix the wheels for me. What's wrong with them? Cause like, no, you, there's like this thing that like tightens and loosens like oh, how they turn and stuff. Yeah. Like I like how he has his set up. You don't, is it too loose? I don't know yet. Yeah, it is really, really loose. Yeah, it's really loose. But isn't it? It's beautiful. No, <laughs> you're scratching yeah, there's it. There's like bumps on it. Well, it's like a grip thing. I don't know why all my kids are turning into skaters. We're not, <laughs> we just like to skateboard. Look at this, because of you, we have to clean our rugs all the time. This thing, guys, actually works really well. It's the Pro Heat two times, blah, blah, blah. Look, it even says Pet Pro on it from these monsters. Look, they might be cute, but they're a pain in the butt. So this rug, I mean, you can't really tell on camera. It's really kind of seen better days, but I've gone through so many rugs while we've lived in this house. I can't keep buying a new rug every year. And they're just going to destroy it. And I've looked, and there's really not a lot that are like, it needs to be a darker color. It wouldn't make any sense to buy a rug with like a light colored background. I just filmed a video for my channel. Um, it was me and Melanie. We did Never Have I Ever, and it was actually oh, no. It was actually really fun. So you guys should definitely go check that out whenever it's posted because it was really funny, and you're gonna learn a lot of new things. So I just wanted to go through and show you all the new clothes that I've been getting. So first are these shorts. I'm not really gonna unfold them because they they're pretty self-explanatory. They're just shorts. They have a tie. They're from Romwe. And then I'm just gonna go through all of these. I got these gray jean shorts. These ones, these are all from PacSun. I got these ones. I just got like a ton of pairs of shorts because I literally don't ever have any. These ones are literally my favorite. These are so cute. These are from American Eagle. They're like mom jean shorts. These are also from American Eagle and they're just all black. And these are shorts that I've previously had. So yeah, I'll show you them again as I put them down. But I just basically, I just basically picked out a ton of new jean shorts. They kind of look a little big, so I'm going to have to dry them on and let you guys know if they fit and, like, if you're going to go shopping there. Now time to show you all the new shirts I've got. I've only got a few so far. I still have more clothes that have not came in yet. So first, <laughs> this shirt is really hard to see. It's from Hollister. I got a bigger size just because it looked really small. It's really hard to tell, but it's like a crossover shirt. Let's see, I'm just going through. Okay, this shirt is literally my favorite. This is also, this is also from Hollister. I also got a medium because they just look so small in the pictures, but I tried it on and it's a little bit big. But it's just, this shirt, it's so cute. It's like a button up, it's blue and floral. I love blue floral shirts, as you can tell, because I have two more right here. Okay, it's continuing to slide through here. I just got this yellow crop shirt from PacSun. It's just a big, like, oversized cropped yellow shirt. I got this black tank top from Romwe. I got this shirt. It's really hard to tell when it's not on, but it's, like, a tie shirt. It goes with those shorts. And I also, I'm not going to take them off the hanger, but I got a matching pair of pants. They're right there. I got this shirt from Abercrombie & Fitch. Literally my favorite shirt ever. It's so cute. The back is like stretchy so you can pretty much get like any size and it'll like fit because also the straps are adjustable. But they had it in like a brown color that I wanted to get but they didn't have the right size. I got this from Romwe. It's just like a little cheetah tank top. Doesn't really fit very well but it's super cute so I don't really care. Pretty much that is all I got but I still wanted to tell you guys that I still have more clothes coming. And there was definitely probably some clothes. Oh, I didn't even show you. This black shirt that I'm wearing right now is also new. It's from PacSun. Along with these shorts, they have the Playboy bunny on them, which kind of isn't that appropriate, but it's really cute, so I don't really care. But yeah, what I was going to say is there's probably some clothes that I didn't get to show you just now because they're either in like my laundry hamper or they have not came yet because some of the shorts that I got or like clothes 
just haven't been delivered yet. Like, I still have some stuff coming in from Romwe. I have a lot of bathing suits that still have to come in and stuff like that. But yeah, so far, those are all, like, the new clothes that I got. And I kind of went all out and got a lot of stuff because I haven't bought clothes since, like, last, like, winter. Like, the last, like, selection of clothes I got that was, like, you know like a big shopping spree was probably back in winter when I got all my sweaters and stuff so I don't really have any new summer clothes except for like the summer clothes from last year and all the new clothes that I just got so I have some stuff from Romley and Zaffel coming in and I think that's it so far so thank you guys for watching my quick little clothing haul so guys finally splurged got myself some new bathing suits just wanted to share them with you because I really feel like Lands End has great bathing suits if you need like coverage like if you don't just want to wear these itty bitty bikinis that a lot of the stores sell I don't know Lands End just has some great suits so I thought I would share them with you guys it's been years since I bought myself new swimsuit you probably noticed I wear the same ones all the time anyways I got this top. I really love the like tankini style. So I got this top. It's navy blue and it has the floral print. So I got the navy blue shorts and I really like them because they have like the pocket right here and they're lined. You can get them without the liner. Like if you don't like it to have like the panty liner. I like it to have a liner. The only thing that I don't love is when you wear these and you walk. It's like this. <laughs> they make the weirdest noise when they're dry once they're wet they're fine and they dry really quick so I just love these and then I got the same exact shorts I got a new black pair and then this is the top tankini top that I got to go with the black shorts it's kind of like a purplish the print's really cute I don't know like all the suits I always end up getting like black and white so I wanted to just add some color so I want to get something a little bit different but this I love they're just comfortable um, another option you can get when you buy these is if you want it to have like the tummy control and I'll show you the difference so this of course has like almost like the bra because it has the underwire and you know this is just a regular swimsuit one of the older ones that I bought a few years ago this has the tummy control the, it has tummy control so the whole line the whole lower portion of the swimsuit has this extra lining see the like elastic right there and and it's like tighter than the actual swimsuit so instead of it kind of just draping on you like a shirt it kind of hugs you more and so it just provides like I don't know a little bit extra tummy control and then what's nice about this one now you can't see is it actually has like this little like it crosses sort of so you have this that's providing tummy control and then this kind of extra I don't know whatever I mean I like it and it does make you feel a little bit slimmer but um it's very constricting so if you're going to be wearing a bathing suit like say you're going on vacation and you're going to be in a bathing suit for many many hours i don't know like you know i guess i'm just to the point in my life that i accept my body for what it is and i'm not like fooling anybody by putting something like this on and like oh wow she looks slim you know what i mean so I'm okay with just a regular tankini top and being a little bit more comfortable. Now one thing that I also bought new and I wasn't really sure how I felt about this is I bought a bikini top. This is also from Lands End. It's underwire so literally I feel like I'm wearing a bra out to sunbathe. Now I still will wear it with the shorts. I won't wear like bikini bottoms. And I don't know, I guess just to get a little bit more suntan. I don't know why it really matters with my tummy suntan. But I just thought, well, I'll get one and see how I feel. And I can tell you, I would never wear this outside of my own backyard. I would not wear this, like, on vacation at a public pool, anything like that. But I did get a bikini top. I have not had one since... Mm, probably about 10 12 years ago that is actually going to be it for today's video thank you guys so much for joining us stay tuned because we have some major major exciting announcements coming up this week and um i think you'll be excited for all of them i know we are 
All right, guys. Bye. See you tomorrow.